Hey everyone. In this video, I want to share with you something most people are completely unaware of. Yes, we all know that Satan is an evil being and the statue that they just erected in Detroit is in fact disgusting. But before showing you that statue, I'd like, this, I'd like for you to see a couple of pictures that may enlighten you as to who is really behind all the evil that is in the world today. All right? Okay, check out this statue. And notice the hand and the way the hand's being held, okay? This is actually the original statue in the pagan church called Jupiter. The Vatican, of course, renamed it St. Peter. Look at the foot. Notice how there are no features of the foot in regards to uh, the toes. I mean, look at the other foot. You can see all the toes and the toenails and stuff like that. But that foot is so worn down because billions of people have kissed it. This thing's about four feet off the ground. So the Roman Catholics come by and they kiss it or touch it. Lips have actually worn down that bronze statue. All right, that's how many people have been deceived into worshiping statues. Okay, but, but now look at this. This is Hitler's Pope. This is the Pope that helped Hitler do the things that he did. Look at his hand. Okay, all right, so you got him doing it, and you got this statue doing it as well, right? Now look at the uh, statue that they, that they put up in Detroit. All right, now I can't really show you this hand here because it's kind of like, the, the way they took the picture, it, it's not coming out very well. And the reason I'm bringing that up is because a lot of people are going to say, well, look at the difference here. The, the, the thumb is out on the Pope's hand, and the thumb is in on Baphomet's hand, right? But here's another statue of Baphomet. Okay, now, yeah, the thumb is in on the, on the right hand of the statue, but look at the left hand. The thumb is out, just like the Pope. Now, here's something else that you need to take a look at, though. A lot of people miss this as well. Look at his belly. Okay, and look at the one that's in Detroit. Look at his belly. Looks familiar, don't it? Notice the wings behind Baphomet. And then the two snakes, or serpents rather, that are, you know, surrounding that uh, scepter, if you will. All right, check this out. That's the AMA logo. Exact same ball on the top as Baphomet. Same ball. All right, same two serpents spinning around it. And the same two wings behind it. All right. Now, if uh, you go to my website, and the reason I share that thing with the, uh, the American Medical Association is because a lot of people aren't aware of this. All right. If you go to uh, RCC Exposed and you go down to Horrific, you go to um, Big Pharma in Rome and you want to check this page out when you get a chance. The Vatican has been caught red-handed, just like Revelation 18 verse 23 said they would be caught. They're in bed with Big Pharma. The word sorceries in Revelation 18, verse 23, is actually from the Greek pharmakia. And that's where we get the word pharmacy today. All right? And then um, to further nail this down, check out this page on my site. Go to Horrific again and go down to the bottom. You might want to check this out. They have been caught holding satanic services. That's right. Satan worshiping services inside the Vatican walls. So I just thought I'd make this video really quick so I can share with everybody as to what's really going on out there. The Vatican's a lot more evil than people realize. It is the perfect way to infiltrate the Christian church. Just like a spy from Russia would come to America and act like an American, you're going to get Satan going into a Christian church acting like a Christian, just like the prophecy said. And so the Vatican has been, in fact, exposed. As a matter of fact, when you get a chance, just go to the Antichrist section of RCC Exposed and go to Characteristics characteristics of Antichrist. I've done videos on this and everything, but uh, every prophecy that's ever been uttered in the scriptures that has anything to do with Antichrist have been fulfilled by the popes of Rome. And I'm not saying that they're the Antichrist. That's Satan. They're just his puppet, and they will do that which he tells them to do. And I've also done a video on this too as well called Satanism in the Vatican. Uh, Satanism practiced by the popes, rather. It's on YouTube. So, Oh, and there's uh, one more thing I wanted to add that, um, like, in, in that video I did about Satanism practiced by the popes. I go into a little bit of detail in regards to how the Vatican is structured, and it's actually uh, the form of an upside-down cross. If you go to the end of the video, you'll see what I mean there. You just get, um, well, I showed the keyhole to give you an idea, but there's the keyhole. And uh, if you scroll down a little bit in the video, you'll see that on the bottom of the keyhole is an upside-down cross. But when you get a chance, check this out when you go to Google. Just put in popes, upside-down cross, 
and uh, you'll get plenty of information there. So thank you for watching. God bless.